makeup today my brows are due for a tint but I actually really like the very minimal feathery look and it really matches with my um, my hair but talking about hair we are gonna do hair together but before we do that I just oh, I've been struggling the past few days to export this damn birthday vlog which is a couple of vlogs ago now um but the reason was because this vlog is so massive and because i export in like high res pro the absolute best quality that i can the files are extremely large so i use an external hard drive to like export my vlogs onto and then as soon as they are uploaded and Especially when I'm working with a brand, I like save these videos and I keep them for a couple of months in case they want them or something happens to them so that I just have them. Um, but my hard drive that I've been using for probably the past two or three years, bless her heart, she has been working so hard for me. She literally just retired and last night, probably just before six I ran to the store and bought a new one minutes and I'm, I'm talking about minutes the doors were already closed they were busy closing I think I was like the last customer that they allowed in macro so I ran and just got a new one and these things are so expensive but oh anything to just make my job so much easier and to get the absolute best quality for my leafies and just yeah you are all so so worth it so i'm excited to have the birthday vlog finally up and to be able to edit all of these videos that i need to edit so they might just be a little bit of a delay or skip of some days i don't even want to say it because i really just wanted to post every day but i'm gonna do my best this month to post as much as i possibly can so i hope you enjoyed the last couple of vlogs but today is going to be another yeah, kind of content day we are gonna have dinner with my brother and sister-in-law tonight he needs help with a video so he's bribing me with a good steak <laughs> and of course I said yes so he's gonna pick me up later and we're gonna get like a head start and then brain will just join us afterwards but before we get started on the day I need to do or before we get started with our day I need to do this hair I haven't done anything to it so i got this really beautiful package from phillips and this stunning note how pretty is this little sparkly bit but yeah we have a couple of things in here so we have a little hair clip and then oh let me just open this so that i can show you properly okay i'm gonna pop you on the tripod um it's such a gloomy and dark day outside i have the blinds like fully open and i feel like the background is so dark still but yeah this is the package we have a really pretty like hair clip and then i thought that this was so cool i kind of had a peek but i haven't taken these out yet because i wanted to open it with you this is a hair dryer holder I haven't seen these but it is by the brand steel craft and I just love it when brands um, like add personal touches like this to a package especially this how cute is this pink robe this is stunning it says Jessica on the back and then we have two products in here we have some coconut oil but two um, Philips products. So this is the dry care, uh, beautiful hair protected inside and out. It boosts shine and preserves hair, hair's natural moisture. Has a volume diffuser and a styling nozzle. Um, has a heat and a cool setting. So 
like this. It's really pretty. So it's like a moisture protect hair dryer. And then I actually bought one of these. If you can remember, I think it was probably like a year ago. I bought one of these and <laughs> it wasn't good. I think it was just some sort of clicks brand. I can't even remember. But I am so happy because I've been wanting one of these for the longest time. So I'm excited to see if this one works. I think I'm going to use this one because my hair's already dry. Um, and I don't really need to like dry it. So I will taste this when my hair has been washed again. And then I'll ask Brain to like put this up for me in my beauty room. So I'm going to plug this straightener in it says naturally straight hair in five minutes i feel like my hair is straight but i feel like i want to have my hair really like curly and tested out but that will probably be in like a video coming up or something but let me open her up and plug her in normally not uh sorry the fan is probably so loud um but i'm normally not like an instruction <laughs> reading person but when it comes to my hair i'm not going to take chances so it's pretty easy to like show you pictures um but basically there are two um heat settings so we have one for 170 degrees and then we have two for 200 200 is for like thick hair and 170 or the first setting is for like thin to medium hair i don't have thick hair i don't think i have thick hair i have a lot of hair but i don't have thick hair and before i actually put it on i think what's really cool about this is it kind of i don't know i think if you're traveling it's quite travel friendly because you wouldn't need to pack an additional brush because there's a brush in here already. So I'm actually, before I put it on, I'm just gonna quickly brush through my hair. Cause I obviously haven't done anything to my hair when I woke up this morning. So I'm just starting from the bottom and then like working my way to the roots but yeah my hair is quite straight i went to the salon like literally a few days ago like two days ago oh look at, the fr look at this uh static okay so i'm gonna part my hair that's fine and then i'll put it on heat number one and i think it flashes like that when it's still heating up I just want to get to you I've been trying for some time Cause I've been waiting Waiting here for someone like you ooh, ooh, ooh. We go together Like misery likes company But we'll be getting there somehow Nothing else matters It all goes down mirror just now but i wanted to show you the very minimal hair fallout and the fact that the bristles of the straightening brush is very gentle and comfortable it doesn't like pull or tug at my hair and i just felt very comfortable like in my hands i love that this is quite long so it's very comfortable to work with it just takes like a couple of tries to get the hang of it but i also love that it has like a safety feature in it the bristles here the black ones they get warm to the touch but not hot where you can burn yourself the shorter ones that are slightly purple those are the ones that actually heat up and straighten your hair this panel around the bristles get a little bit hot but i didn't touch that once and then the back panel gets warm but not completely hot where you potentially burn yourself like I did here with a previous hot tool completely my fault but it's nice to know that 
you know you're a little bit protected in potentially burning yourself but let me go show you um my hair in the bathroom my hair is quite long so i need to like bend down to show you but i love that it just created like a natural like swoop to my hair i tried to like turn it at the end so that it just looks like a very natural blowout and because my hair is a little bit curly and when i wash my face at night i get the front pieces a little bit wet and like my skincare goes on there so i just need a little bit of dry shampoo so my hair feels nice and fresh and silky I'm such a wild sleeper so <laughs> I get a fresh blowout and then the next day I need to like make it nice and sleek again good job love it so it's been a little while since we last spoke um just been doing some work and i'm making myself whoops that's way too much milk uh, let me keep some of it for later just kind of spoon some of this on top i am working with nescafe so i want to do a really cute picture with my coffee everywhere we go nobody knows we're waiting for a sign to let it go and do what's right for us started out here way beyond the tracks the story of us and how we never look back because this is our time this is our life and sometimes all you need is to smile so i have now taken my photo i'm gonna enjoy my coffee in just a second but i'm trying to like set up a background for this box over here i'm trying to shoot a video before my brother comes so yeah i have this plant in the background i like the pop of green in the back i think this is called a peace lily which i don't think i've watered it this week yet i will do that in just a few minutes i just want to get this out of the way so i got this delivery i think like yesterday so it came a little bit late so i am a little bit pressed for time but it's okay we will make it work we have some nescafe recipes we've got a dark mint which is so up my alley this one is an apple spy like cinnamon and apple but i definitely think i'm gonna try this one it looks amazing I have a little card that says, hey coffee lover, thank you for joining Nescafe and celebrating International Coffee Day. We have a little hat, some cards. Ooh, that's cool. I love these iced coffees and lattes. I think this is like a mask. You know I love these. And then we have an ivory roast and then a classic roast. My favorite is the um, Nescafe Gold um but i mean coffee as long as it's strong and good i am happy i love these so you can kind of see the background i like the pop of green in the back so i'm just gonna do like a little unboxing and maybe take a sip of coffee i don't know we'll see <laughs> so get back. how cute is this bucket hat i think you call it a bucket hat it just says international coffee day on the front and i've never actually worn one of these or had one of these but i'm going to try it work because make it work because it was part of the delivery and i had the idea of doing like a dark roast and a blonde medium roast kind of vibe i have these two identical tops from zara it's like a mock neck with short sleeve and i was thinking of doing like a jump transition and keeping my jeans on and i don't know i don't know how i come up with these things but we are gonna try it and hopefully it works we're one step closer to find ourselves a perfect place a feeling you just can't deny so come on over cause i could never live without you okay i am all 
done with my Nescafe content. I'm busy importing the video footage and now. I took my um, first post with the hot coffee and then the video kind of includes both. And then I thought I would kind of do a post. I wanted to do a post with this and I wanted to do, I don't know, like a really cool iced coffee vibe. And then I saw this post on Kay's Instagram. She's also working with Nescafe and oh my goodness, I am obsessed. This Frenchy coffee and designer vibes is just exactly what I'm going for. I don't have a Frenchie and I'm not as cool as Kay but I'm gonna try and do like my little version of it I'm gonna do it in my room kind of having the idea around heading out for errands grabbing my on-the-go coffee with my you know silver metal straw so I have my bag and I took some photos and I'm gonna just sit down and edit that for a little bit my brother is running a little bit late so i have maybe an hour or two still he actually um arranged with my sister-in-law to pick me up she ends work earlier than brain and i want to get there to kind of help him with the editing before we have dinner last night we went to Bren's action cricket for the first time in like a year and we got home a little bit late because of course i didn't want to tell him like let's go home and i just allowed him to um have his time with his friends but i think we got into bed at like half past 11 can't remember but um i don't want to get into bed that late again but i'm also thinking of maybe shooting the first bit of another campaign that i'm working on oh my goodness so incredibly get uh, <laughs> so incredibly blessed god is just blessing me with everything and I'm just so thankful um but yeah I'm working with L'Occitane I always thought it was L'Occitane or L'Occitane but it's L'Occitane I googled it to make sure that I have the correct pronunciation but let me actually show you this package I've been wanting to work with them for the longest time the products are a little bit pricey but just so luxurious and just so gorgeous and it's all about like florals and if you ever walked in a mall and saw this beautiful like yellow shop with a lot of products that's the brand that i'm talking about and yeah let me show you this unboxing but first let me show you this outfit because i think it's perfect so the dress is from a brand called pretty in pink they are a south african brand and this little set was it's $5.99 but they oh so kindly asked me to select a couple of pieces on their site and I chose this dress not even thinking of using it for this L'Occitane content but how I have this purple one too by the way um but how perfect is this um but let me show you the package and the products from L'Occitane I just have it on the floor in my beauty room but these are the products and I just wanted to keep it all together in case I needed anything or needed to shoot anything but this is the product it's like an overnight mask I, I already started to use it and I absolutely love it and then they included some extra little samples and this beautiful bag okay so I think that Maybe I can shoot a little bit of this content now. Hmm. No, actually I can't. Because I'm not supposed to have makeup on when I apply my skincare. So maybe do like a little bit of intro aesthetic bits at um, Nico and B's house. Um, because they actually live in a house with a garden. So hopefully everything's green there. But I think I'm going to edit and pack my things and then... The next time you'll see me is in the car with V. Everywhere we go, nobody knows. We're waiting for the time to let it go and do what's right for us. Started out here, way beyond the tracks. The story of us, and now we never look back. Cause this is our time, this is our time.
so it's the next day i filmed a little bit this morning and it's been one of those days so i'm gonna do my hair whilst i talk to you because brain is picking me up in like a minute um but it's been one of those days where i literally just had my eyes glued to my laptop i was just in such a zone to edit so i edited a full vlog and then i also did two campaign videos and i did a little bit of like last bits for that loxitan video that i talked to you about yesterday i started filming it in my brother and sister sister sister-in-law's sister nico and b's garden um but i can show you that because i was basically chasing the sun um and i had like five minutes to get a couple of shots before the sun went away and then after that we had dinner and i helped my brother edit this video for his work and him and my sister-in-law actually work together so they look they work for like a a law firm i think i think it's a law firm and they have a lot of employees and they did this jerusalem video i'm pretty sure you know exactly um what i'm talking about the dance that the president kind of challenged everyone to so they did that and my brother kind of like filmed it and he wanted to um have me edit and like kind of help him um and it was so much fun to edit that video but it took hours and hours i think we got there at around i think we got started at around 6 30 and we left there at about 11 but um it was so worth it because he sent me a reaction video this morning of everyone reacting to the video and it's just always so worth the time to just see everyone's happiness and just how everyone likes it so um, it was an absolute pleasure but i was a little bit tired today but i did my work still i just didn't vlog as much because i wanted to get as much editing done today but we are gonna go for dinner so i thought i would just kind of continue the vlog into the evening i had no idea what to make for dinner um but then brain said we should go to turn and tender but we had steak last night my brother made us the most amazing steak um so i don't think i'm gonna have steak again tonight it's been the gloomiest like rainiest day today um our brain just got you it's been the rainiest like gloomiest day today um so I am just feeling like something warm, like maybe a muscle soup or I don't know, something like that. But let me just quickly show you my outfit and then go downstairs. Started out here, way beyond the tracks. The story of us and how we never look back. Cause this is our time, this is our life. And sometimes all you need is a smile. got home from dinner had a bath and then got into bed and then this morning when i woke up um i remembered that i showed you this little dress earlier in the vlog so i was like oh that's perfect i will just kind of continue the vlog and as i said i want to vlog every single day but that doesn't mean I am going to post a vlog every single day because sometimes my days are just not as eventful so I kind of have to compress a few days into one to give you like a worthy vlog because I'm pretty sure that you Liffies will be really upset if I post like a five minute <laughs> vlog so rather a little bit longer than um, posting short very meaningless vlogs every single day so that's what i'm doing and again we are back in the bathroom with the hair last night i did a bun and today i'm just doing like a low pony with this 
little scrunchie. I think it's really pretty. Let's do a little bit more hairspray. I am on in 10 minutes with Brutal Fruit, so I have a live, and I thought that this would be like the perfect little outfit, but it is a little bit too small for me, so I've just pinned it in case, um, and, well not pinned it in case, I used two pins in case one decides to like pop open, imagine that would be so embarrassing in the live. Um, so if one kind of pops open, I have another backup. But I'm going to go set up. I have a live with Brutal Fruit this morning or this afternoon. Um, I'm up first and then it is Tubsy and Kamo. So um, yeah, let me just put a little bit of, I don't know, a little bit of body oil on just to glow. And then we can go and sit up. Okay, so I have my setup. <laughs> I am literally like scrambling. I have like seven minutes. I'm gonna huh, just put this kind of in the background. Okay, so I am ready. I have. <laughs> my little brutal fruit in the background because hashtag product placement and it is like a paid partnership after all so they didn't tell us to but I just figured I would just kind of sneak it in in the back but actually thought my time was 12 o'clock on the dot but it's actually 20 past so I'm kind of just gonna tune in and see because it starts Oh shoot, I just did. Okay, I just posted a story um, saying that I'm on in five minutes. Um, but I don't know, hopefully that will kind of take some time to reach everyone's profile because I'm only on in 20 minutes. So I don't know, but I'm going to tune into the Glamour Live anyway and watch it until I... I'm on, I guess. Come, come, give me some more of that sugar spawn. I can't stop thinking about it. And we are done with the live. I literally just wore this dress with sweatpants, but it is like a rouged dress. I think it goes up until like here, but no one knew and I wanted to be comfortable but that literally went so quick let me know in the comments if you joined in for the live um, but I'm pretty sure if you missed it um, you can go to Glamour's Instagram I'm pretty sure they will save like an IGTV and then you can watch it I'll try and link it down below but this vlog has come to a close I am literally gonna change and get ready for my content but I'm gonna start a brand new vlog so I will see you ladies in the next one enjoy your day or your night depending on when you watch this and then I'll see you in the next one Mwah.